Hello everybody, this is a different video. You know the Indiana Jones movie's coming out soon, and I'm a huge Indiana Jones fan. You probably noticed that I did a couple of Indiana Jones. I'm doing Indiana Jones comic re uh, reviews right now, or showing them off, and I did a novels. Anyway, I don't want to bore you with details. I like Indiana Jones. So, I'll show off my Sankara stone, made by, uh, you can barely see the stamp. It's called Land Land Drone Artifacts. I'll put the link in the description below. I'm not associated with him at all, but I just want to show, show off my... Uh, Stone I got from it's. If you listen to this, I'll read his facts here. It says, uh, This is a hand painted replica. It's cast solid and has a stone like weight. It is. It's about, it feels like, like three pounds at least. It's heavy. And feel. It's meticulous attention to detail has been applied to achieve an amazing, uh, convincing stone like appearance. You can see that. And it measures about five and a half uh, inches tall. I don't have a scale. I could have done a scale there, but. I just want to turn it over here. You can see all the detail. I mean, I do have a shadow, don't I? But, uh, I mean, look at that. Little specks of dust. Little cracks. Ignore my hairy, uh, unmanicured hands. But uh, there's the scrapes on it. And it's, like I said, it's really, really heavy. Um, here's the scale. I got this. This is uh, something I've had since I was a kid. I'm, uh, I was born in 74, so when Temple of Doom came out, it was 84. I saw it when I was 10 years old. And this is a toy I've had since then. It doesn't really look like Harrison Ford, but as a kid, you loved this. Look at his little whip. His little, his little machete. His. So I guess it's uh, kind of showing off this, too. This some people don't see. The hat actually comes off, which is amazing. Look at that. Isn't that the neatest thing? Yeah, I've had this since I was a kid. I had Mauler Ram, but he's missing. I think his head came off. That's the only two I had. I had Mauler Ram and him. But that's not the point. You're here for the Sankara Stone, which I'll... Uh, like, I'll put the link below. Like, so I'm not, uh, you know, associated with him at all. But I just love this thing so much. It sits by my bookshelf. There's a stamp, like I said before. It sits on my bookshelf right by my Indiana Jones novels. And it's just, I mean, it's a, like I said, it's really heavy. It feels like, you know, stone. So there's not much to really, it's going to be a short uh, video because there's not much to say. I just want to show it off and I guess you can see the top of it, you know. But uh, can I get a little closer? I, yeah, I have a shadow on here today. Maybe if I move this over like this. No. Nope. There we go. Let me push this button. This sometimes will bring it into focus. Sometimes. Well, that's better. Let's do this real quick, and then I'll be done with the video. There's still a shadow there, but you get the gist. Move it around. There we go. I'll get better at this someday. But, uh... Yeah, you can see the shadow, but... You can see the, like, oh, the crack. I mean, it's a really... Uh... Look at that. I'm glad I'm doing this so you can see it. Little specks of dust on it. I feel like Indiana Jones. Look at the little scrapes. I mean, and he, currently, as this, as this video is being uh, going out today, it, he's selling it for because the price could change. You know, how prices go up and, or down. So, you know, it's so cool. look at the cracks there. The scrapes, like I said, these are real scrapes. They're just painted on like some people do. This is scraped up. You know, look at that. This is one of my most prized possessions. I love this thing. And I think he sells it for $45 plus $10 shit. So it's not cheap. It's $50, 50 to $55. So, But if you want the real deal, let me get the glare off a little bit. I think this is the real deal. This is, ah, it's it's a heavy thing. I guess I can do this real quick since I have them here. But yeah, this is, uh, this came out. I'll look, I'll, I forget the company name. Let me see if I can find it real quick. I think it's uh, Ella. I'll do a quick edit. Anyway, back to what I was saying. This is by a company called LJN, and for this for their Temple of Doom action figure line, uh, they had big plans, but they only made three figures. They made Mauler Ram, a giant thuggy. I'll throw some pictures up. A Mauler Ram, a giant thuggy, and, Tim, and of course Indiana Jones. Um, but they only made his whip fell. I just leave it down there. They only made uh, three, though. They, they made the Thuggy, Miller Ram, Indiana Jones. Sorry about that. And what was he? Oh, yeah. And they had plans to do Short Round and Willie Scott. 
but they never made them. So I guess they didn't do well. Didn't sell well, I guess. But I had one. And here it is. My mom or dad got it for me. I don't know. But anyway, huge chump. Uh, Temple of Doom is my favorite Indiana Jones, but not just my favorite Indiana Jones. It's my favorite movie of all time. Of all the movies I've seen, I still had the most fun. I think it might be nostalgia, because I did see it when I was 10 in theaters, and it scared me. It was like a horror film, plus action film, you know, so. But, uh, yeah, this was made by LJN, and I'll put details on that, too, if you, you know. I find I'll show you some of the pictures of the Thuggy and the Malaram. And uh, apparently, this is worth loose 100 to 150 dollars. Oh my gosh, I just looked that up just now while I was talking to you. And if it's still mint on card, you know, still in the package, it's worth 350 to 450. I never knew that. Yeah. So if I ha this is worth 100 to 150 dollars. That's funny. I'm not gonna sell it. Like I said, I've had it. F I'm 49 years old now, and you know, I, why would I get rid of it now? But anyway, this video is about this. So. Hope you liked the video. A little long. I didn't think it was going to be that long, but I guess it because I started talking about this, too. But, yeah, I just thought I'd throw it out there because the movie's coming out. Uh, the new Indiana Jones. My favorite one is uh, Temple of Doom. That's the one I watched the most. Uh, Last Year's I probably watched second most because of Sean Connery. And third, I watched Raiders. It's not about the movie, is it? This is about the Sankara Stone. So, the link's in the description below. And uh, if you want to check it out, so if you're a Temple of Doom fan like like me, you have to have this. And I have more Indiana Jones stuff. I have more Temple of Doom stuff. I got the original poster, a uh, video poster when it was came out on VHS. They were selling it for uh, twenty nine ninety five back in nineteen eighty six. That's when Temple of Doom came out on VHS. Now, if you account for inflation, that's like buying Indiana Jones on DVD today for ninety dollars. See? Media, man. That was expensive back then. But anyway, hope everybody's having a great day. Enjoy the day. And, uh, yeah, check out my channel for my other videos. All right, everybody. Have a great day today, okay? And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.